answering some questions. I found them on Google because I was really, really extremely lazy. But I hope you guys enjoy this video and hopefully you'll know more facts about me. Anyway, let's jump right into the video. So the first question is, do you miss anyone or anything right now? I miss my late grandfather. He's been gone now for almost 11 years. It'll be 11 years this November since his passing. I wish he was here right now, cancer free and pain free. That'd be like my only wish for to have him here right now. But unfortunately, he's not, Sally. So the next question is, what are your plans for tonight? Probably Netflix and chill by myself. When did you go, wait, when did you, when did you last go on vacation? I went on vacation last summer. I went to Prince Edward Island. I went to visit some family I have down there and now they're actually here visiting and they're here until Friday so it's nice having them here. I really miss them. What TV shows do you like? I like a variety of different shows. My favorite show that I loved so much, I still love it, it's Once Upon a Time. It just finished after 11, I think it was 7 years or so they were running the show for. And they just finally ended with season 7 being their final season. I really miss Once Upon a Time. I'm going to miss it a lot. Because every Friday at 8 o'clock on ABC, it was lit, yo. Like, it was lit. Like, if you are a sir like I am, you will understand my pain. And if you haven't watched Once One Time, it is on Netflix right now. They have seasons 1 to 6, so you better get caught up before they put season 7 on there. What? Uh, where is your best friend? My best friend is, where is my best friend? Hmm. My best friend's seeing Harry Styles right now without me. Hashtag no fair, but I told her to spam me. She better, she better spam me. Worst injury you've ever had. I never had any injuries. I've been really fortunate to never have broken a bone at all. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Ooh, oh my god. Stop fucking lying. But I would have to say the worst injury I've ever had would have to be when I sprained my ankle and when I went to Collingwood. Not Hollywood. Collingwood. It's in Canada. And... I went to this big dog park in Barrie, which is also in Canada, and this dog park was huge. It was massive, and I walked around it, and then the next day I was walking funny, and then my grandmother was like, uh, why are you walking funny? And I said, no, I'm not. Yeah, it turns out my ankle was swollen like a balloon, so that was a little painful. When did you last go, sh go for shopping? I went to the mall recently, a couple weeks ago with my friend. I actually did a Lush haul, actually. If you haven't seen my Lush haul, link down below. Have you watched any movies this week? Yes, I have. If you know me, if you know me, if you haven't seen the poster right there, I have watched Beauty and the Beast this week. Beauty and the Beast is my favorite movie in the whole wide world. I... Love Beauty and the Beast. I love it. It's the best movie in my opinion. What are you listening to now? The current tune I am listening to right now is Young Blood by Fast Sauce. It is such a bop. Like, oh my god. I love it. And the one song that I think that needs more appreciation is Seen Blind by Niall. Oh my god, I love seeing blind. Him and oh my god, that oh my god. Youngblood and seeing blind are my jams. And perfect by One Direction as well. Speaking of One Direction, I have a question for you guys. Do you think we directioners should go on a hiatus just to prove to One Direction how it feels to be without their fans? 
because you know so they can feel our pain because they've been away for far too long and I think they need to come back soon or else I'm or else I think we directioners should go and hide us and just prove them wrong and make them and make them feel our pain comment down below of we should do that as directioners I think we should what were you doing three hours ago? I was cooking dinner for my grandma. My grandma is waiting on a hip and a knee replacement. So I offered to cook her dinner tonight because she wasn't feeling so great. So I, every now and then I cook dinner for my grandma. I love to cook and it takes the load and stress off her. And I just, I don't have a problem doing it for her. I love doing it for her. Who was the last person you chat with on Facebook? My mom. I talk to my mom a lot on Facebook. Even though she lives in the same town as me, and even though she's a phone call away, I like to text her a lot. Let's see. What are you eating now? Nothing, but I probably will eat fruit later. I don't want to think about food right now. I'm too full. I kind of pigged out. Dinner tonight? Dinner was fantastic. I... I do say so myself. What sport do you play? Um, I don't play any sports, but I used to. I used to do bowling, actually. I used to be in a bowling league. That was a lot of fun, but the age limit for the bowling league I was in was up to 19. So after that, you can't bowl anymore in that league unless you want to do an adult league, league which I am in the works of trying to find an adult league. So let's see, let's see, I'll answer two more questions. Can you fart in public? I'm just gonna be honest with you guys, so if you're being team, if I farted, y'all would be passed out, like that's how smelly my farts are, they're really gross. And it would just not be a good situation. Would you marry a celebrity? Oh, heck yeah! I would marry Harry Styles if I had the chance. Now, just, just go find where he is. Wait, I do know where he is. My friend is seeing him live in concert. Harry, I'm coming, boo! Anyway, that is it for this Get to Know Me video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want me to do another uh, part two to this video, then give this video a huge thumbs up. And comment down below on some questions you guys want me to answer in my next video.